Hello there everybody, and welcome back to another Let's Play here on GTA World. I hope you all enjoyed the last video there. We ended up uh, doing a lot of pulling over in the last video, that's for sure. So, uh, who knows what this one's going to bring somewhat in the middle of the day, but uh, definitely not the hectic time of the day, that's for sure. But, who knows what it's going to bring? You never really know. We got 391 players online at the moment, and uh, it will be peak hour here in a couple of hours in game. And also, tonight, for those that uh, observe the time change, the time goes back an hour tonight, so uh, you guys gain an extra hour of sleep or an extra hour to do whatever you want, I guess. So uh, it is that time of year already, unfortunately. Personally, I wish they'd leave the time as it is now, so that way, uh, it be light out when I actually leave work instead of being dark when I go to work and dark when I get home. But uh, unfortunately, I'm not the one that makes that decision. So, uh, yeah, got the time change coming up here. Uh, winter's the lumen already, so uh, weather's definitely gotten cooler. It's only six degrees outside today, and uh, definitely you can feel the crisp air uh, and the uh, fall and somewhat the winter starting to set in already. Hopefully, it's not a bad winter because I hate winter. I'm personally a spring summer and early fall fan but that's the weather i like anything other than that not really a big fan i can tell you that that's for sure so we're rolling as our classic two lincoln 54 once again today uh, that seems to be our default number because you know how like in traffic we used to be like two top whatever it was i don't remember anymore if we were for a while but then someone started stealing that number which was uh pretty rude i'll never forgive them for that so uh <laughs> I've been rolling as two Lincoln 54 the last few videos, and that seemed to what I, be what I roll at the most. I can't talk today, so uh, th maybe this will be a struggle for a Let's Play. But uh, <laughs> but that seems to be the unit that I roll as the most, is two Lincoln 54, so we're going to lay our claim on that one for now while I'm online. So, hope you all have had a good week or whatever. Uh, hope you all enjoyed uh, your week, or, I guess, uh, since the last Let's Play. Um, was a fun one, like I said, we pulled quite a few people over, uh, didn't intend for it to be quite one like that, but, uh, that's why it ended up turning out to be, sometimes, uh, just the, uh, card that you draw, and, uh, was one where we, uh, just said, hey, we're pulling everybody over today, I guess, so, uh, that's what it was, so, who knows what today's gonna bring, looks like they just voided attack one situation, I'm not even sure what it was, because I, uh, literally just got online to play, gonna play here for hour or two at least uh and also happy november everybody hard to believe october's over as well hope everyone had a good halloween for those to do it um i wasn't home i was at work and then it was a long day at work so by the time i got home it was like the middle of trick-or-treating so got home changed quickly and just went to the gym i was just done with the day just need to go do something for myself as i'm sure you guys uh probably have to do for yourselves once in a while as well um so yeah other than that, happened up to a whole lot. Uh, I think I mentioned last video I got the car undercoated and everything, so it's all set for the winter. I better turn on my NVIDIA Shadow Play here to make sure that works. And it doesn't even want to open, so uh, we're just going to be relying on old OBS today. Here going to be our trusted partner in crime. Rolling along here, this is technically our turf since for the Lincoln 50 series. That means Vinewood's technically ours to own, um, as well as uh, Mirror Park and whatnot. So uh, that is technically what uh, the Lincoln 50 series owns. Uh, what the 30 series owns, uh, excuse me, 30 series owns South Central, and the uh, 40 series owns uh, like West Valley area and stuff like that. So we all kind of get our. Uh, technically districts I guess but like I mentioned in the previous couple of videos you're you're pretty much free to patrol wherever you want. We have oh lord what do we got? We had a property alarm. Alright. We're running out code until we're closer. I wish we could have our custom sirens still on the server. I miss being able to change out my sirens once in a while. One on the server is like super duper, super duper high quality. <laughs> All 
Alright, we're getting there. When I'm responding to a general call, I definitely like to clear my intersections the best I can. Sometimes it's hard during a pursuit, but definitely when we're responding to a regular old call, I just like to clear them, because it uh, definitely lowers the chance of getting involved in a car accident. That guy's a trucking. Extras didn't load in there, that's weird, haven't had that problem. Yeah, this is strange, I've not had this issue at all. Huh. Like I mentioned in my last video though, my rage has taken a long, long time to load. Uh, it takes like five minutes before it even starts loading the actual game portion. So if anyone knows what's up with that. let me know. We'll go around back. Back here with Schiltz, our old trap buddy. up. This tree is going to have to save my life right now. There's not a whole lot of cover to be had here. This is about as good as we're going to get at the moment. very possible that inside is completely empty as well. Alright. Black has the door behind me, right there, and I've got this one. So, uh, this is about as good, like I said, there's not a whole lot of cover in this backyard. They're inside clearing the house right now. We'll see if uh, they find anybody. Alright, they just cleared the whole house. So nothing inside, so... Uh, Now we get someone MIA. Yeah, so they were here like right after the alarm went off, I guess, and didn't see anything. Oh, sheriffs are here as well. getting cleared from the scene.
Where's he going? All right, now we got to get our way back down the mountains here, or the hills. This ain't no mountain. I am terrible at the roads up here. Um, like I said, I have a general idea of where everything else is in the city. When people call out a road name, plus or minus like 20, 25%. But up here, it just like throws me for a loop. Whatever they're talking about, like pursuit updating up through here. I'm brutal. I'm just like, I have no idea where they're at. Alright, roll them back down into the city now and see what we can find. May not be a uh, traffic stoppy kind of day like the last one. Could be other things, which is fun because uh, I enjoy, personally, I enjoy having a bit of a variety. I don't know about you guys. Just rolling around. Like I said, it's usually not too, too hectic yet. Once you get to like peak hour, things can get pretty crazy. Personally, I don't really enjoy, do and I know it might sound weird, I don't personally enjoy doing a Let's Play during peak hour because sometimes it's just so hectic that it's just, it's very hard to make a video in that situation, if that makes sense. So like, sometimes you just go from call to call to call to call to call, and it's very hard to have like a normal Let's Play, and it's hard to update you guys on things and whatnot when it is so hectic. And then there's other times as well where because of how crazy it is, sometimes you can be stuck on one scene for like an hour at a time. And that just doesn't make good video for you guys. So, like I said, I, I much prefer doing my Let's Plays usually in the mornings or, well, afternoons for me before it gets too crazy or sometime in the evening after peak hours over. Like, just kind of that happy medium area seems to kind of give me the, the best results with my videos. And as far as being able to get you guys commentary as I play and all that stuff because it's just that little bit less hectic and I can keep you guys updated. So I think it makes a better video and it's more fun for me because it's a bit less stressful doing a video when it's not peak hour as well. Not too many people out and about today either so far that I've seen. Uh, Usually there's a couple people just chilling about that I'll go talk to, but I haven't even seen too, too many of them yet. We've hit over 400 players online. So, like I said, over the course of the next couple of hours, the server will begin to populate really, really quickly. And it'll probably hit over 800 today because it's Saturday. So, uh, that, like I said, when, when you get up to that amount of people, it, it's nuts. Um, always lots going on. How's everyone over here doing? Ooh. What are we doing? I, I think showing up here was a bad idea. It's uh, a little bit trolly at the moment, so we're just going to uh, casually leave. As you can see. <laughs> we're just... We're, we're going to chill our way out of here. Here we go. Um, yeah, sometimes Davis could be interesting. Sometimes it's good RP. Sometimes it's like, oh my god. Um, I gotta say, this is one of those oh my god moments. So we're just going to go head out. We're going to go patrol elsewhere and uh, have a good time that way. Because, like I said, you do have that ability, which is good. Um, so we're going to go find other more chill out RP. That was... Uh, I said sometimes you do kind of run into to RP situations that aren't what you would call up to snuff. Does that make sense? And I would say that was probably one of them. Yeah. <laughs> What's this guy doing here? Let's see.
What the heck is it picking up at 150 miles an hour? It must have been a helicopter or something up there. That's hilarious. All right. Some random dude just stopped me asking for my name, uh, name and badge number. What the heck is he doing? There's no point in even chasing him. Like, yeah, that was just weird. I said, when you are at a PD or anything, like on any server for that matter, you're always going to encounter, you, you can encounter both the highs and the low, lows of any player base, right? So like, you let people just kind of troll you, just to troll you, it just, it is the way it is. And you just accept it, move on, and enjoy like, what I would say, the good RP moments. And it doesn't matter like, what server you're on, you're always going to have your ups and your downs, of course, it doesn't really matter. But personally, I enjoy it overall. And, I think most people do that are here as well. Near traffic. Near traffic. Cop was just chilling there, then when I drove by they started moving again. I'm like, whoops, oh well. <laughs> there goes Schiltz, I think. He usually drives the gray unmarked uh, torrents. I think that's his favorite ride. That's usually what you see him in. He's been in traffic forever. He was, uh, I believe he was in traffic when I first went to traffic back in 2021. So I think he's been doing it for three years now, which is crazy to think about. There's the car that's blocking the, uh, blocking the way. <laughs> So they're just stuck there right now until the uh, tow truck comes. They've seen it going down that way, so they went the wrong way there for a minute. So hopefully they uh, turn back around and find them. Still just been rolling around here for the last little bit so far. It's been pretty chill at this point. I'm gonna roll in and see how they're all making out here down at the uh, mechanic and repair shop, uh, or the pay and spray as we'd like to call it, see how everything's going check in on them because things can get busy here sometimes I've been in a couple pain sprays even off duty and uh, her will just call them pain sprays for the sake and uh, people have gotten robbed and whatnot so sometimes it's just good to check on them see how everything's going Oh my god, what are they doing? We'll go out and talk to them all, see what's happening. Alright, yeah, usually when they see copper out, they're like, oh god, what happened? But nope, not this time.
<laughs> like that person said. <laughs> That's funny. I think that's supposed to be like a Dodge Hornet or something, that yellow car over there, I don't know. Sometimes those small roleplay interactions are just as fun as the other stuff too, right? Like that, like I said, I like keeping it mixed up, and uh, that helps quite a bit. All right, here we go. Yeah, this area can tend to get busy at night, and uh, over by the beach can get fairly busy too as the darkness will set in on the server here in a couple of hours. One thing I've noticed with this mod though is that it kind of keeps the sky, uh, albeit it's cloudy weather right now, but it kind of keeps the sky like the same look until it hits like 6 or 7 p.m. in game, which is a little weird, but at the same time I don't hate it because where I live four hours behind the server, I believe, what time is, is it in game? It's uh, 5 o'clock in game and 2 o'clock my time so with the time changes tomorrow for me I'll be 4 hours behind the server so it'll help it with the uh, daytime aesthetic a little bit so it won't be like dark every time I log into the server um, which is nice because personally I don't like playing at nighttime all the time like when I get on or let's say I play in the evening it's dark at the server period there's no getting around it I remember when I first started playing, it was, uh, what the heck is that car doing? That dude is full on troll. Sometimes it's just not worth your time. We're gonna see. What the hell he's doing? What is he doing? Yeah, he's just a full-on troll. It's not worth it. It is not worth it.
Well, that sucks. I thought I was recording that whole time, but uh, I guess I wasn't. I got uh, mixed up with what I was doing there. So we responded to this call, and uh, anyways, uh, th they just needed help because there was probably a good 10 or 15 people outside when we rolled up, but once poor cops showed up, they just kind of dispersed and took off. Now there's only a few people. So now we're just sitting here chatting and whatnot. I apologize. I missed the last, uh, at least the last 10 minutes of recording. Accidents are going to happen. Slippery finger, I guess, is what we're going to call this one. Uh, but otherwise, uh, it's just been a pretty chill scene. Just uh, had to kind of put up a little bit of a wall just to kind of keep people back and whatnot. But otherwise, yeah. So right now they were getting them on a window tint right now. They're arguing about it in the Buffalo. So uh, we're going to see. Looks like they'll probably definitely be getting a ticket for the uh, window tint. I don't know what else, of course, but uh, sucks for them. <laughs> Hope you all have been joined by Let's Plays back and whatnot. This will be my fourth or fifth one, I believe, now. Uh, I didn't kind of lost count. What did I restart at? 81, I believe. So yeah, this should be the fifth video that I have out for you guys. So it's been good to be back. You just try and get a video out every week or so if I can, of course, uh, like I used to do. So as I said, do hope you guys enjoy that and whatnot. Uh, it's, been, it's been fun being back. I've had some fun times. see uh oh they're taking his car <laughs> it's been his fifth time for excessive speed holy crap And he disconnected. Classic. I think they did find the, uh, oh, where am I going? For 10 day impound, I threw my computer as well. <laughs> 10 days. That's gonna be rough. Hope he has a secondary car. All right, the guy has returned after about six, seven minutes of waiting. Like I said, um, I, I was having an issue. Exo 16 foot pursuit, Charleston, Daquan. Oh God, I am having an issue where my uh, game takes a while to load it just shows a black screen and then after about five minutes to load right into the game I don't know if anyone else is having that issue if you are let me know if you have any ideas on how to fix it I've already reinstalled the clean rage and everything but didn't seem to fix it I don't know why it's happening I don't know rage update or something but definitely very odd so yeah this guy's suspended his license for 10 days and impounding his car for 10 days so he's going to have a really fun time with that one they just announced a foot pursuit but they already got four units responding to it at the moment so uh they should be all right with that they're down at charleston though so uh who knows that place is uh always up and down what you're gonna get
$20,000. Holy shit. That one's in a burn. Holy shit. That poor guy. I have no idea what SO to me means. I assume he wants my channel name. All right, rolling out. Yeah, like I said, it sucks. I missed there probably about a good five, ten minutes of recording, unfortunately. But uh, those things are going to happen. What the heck? I think the server's lagging a little bit. There we go. All right, rolling back out on patrol. Hopefully the tow truck isn't too long getting there for him. Yeah, the bars and stuff on the server do seem to attract quite a few people, though, so you do have to keep your eye on them. So, just as an example of how quickly people do log on this time of day, we started, there was like 380, and now in just an hour, we're already sitting at 495 people. So let's, I mean, like, when, when we approach peak hour, people do log on quite, quite quickly, so we'll be at 500 people here pretty much any second at this point. Probably in the next four or five minutes, we'll hit 500, and then 
probably another hour being six or seven hundred. So things really do uh, pick up quite quickly on the server, people-wise. So the time to be online is usually between 3 and 4 p.m. Eastern time, all the way until about 6 or 7 p.m. Eastern time. Are the peak hours, and it was about the same thing when I played Red County Roleplay back in the day. The peak hours would be about the same because there's a lot of European players, and that's when both of them get home. And usually a lot of the U.S. players will both converge to the time zones to be able to play. And that's usually what uh, makes the server population so big during those uh, few hours. White game I'd like to start playing again is War Thunder. I have not played it in months and months and months. I always had fun playing it. I always wanted to get to the fighter jets. Um, gonna be honest, I'm one of those people that uh, I'm one of those people that uh, plays on arcade mode. Please don't judge me. <laughs> yeah, please don't judge me about the playing on arcade mode because uh, that's what I uh, that's what I enjoy playing. 